this video from Sharper. We're going to take a look at how you can cut down a lot of unnecessary information you might be getting on your end of day Z report. Um, so I'll actually run a Z report now. To some people this information is useful but to a lot of people uh, not all of it necessarily is. Um, so at the top you get grand totals which can be confusing because they're You've got three grand totals on there and then a training mode total. Um, a lot of people are just interested in the figures at the bottom, so the amount of money you've taken and whether you've taken it by cash or card and then information to do with the tax and then the sales by department, all that's quite useful. Uh, but in this video I'll show you how to get rid of the um, grand total information. Um, so it's fairly straightforward, there's basically a place in the programming mode, um, programming menu, which controls what appears on your reports. You can't take everything off, but you can take certain things off. So you press mode, and then you go to line 6, TLNS, into setting, and then we're looking for report, which is number 9, and then we're looking for print select, and go into there. So you've got... Um, bits of information on there. Z counter, I quite like having a Z counter on there because it proves there's not any nonsense going on of loads of different reports being printed out and then ripped up or whatever. Um, so the GTs is what I'm looking to get rid of. So you go to each one, when it's highlighted press subtotal, toggle to no and then press TMST. So I've gone down to yes for GT2 on Z, TMST, no, GT3 on Z, no, which says yes, so I go TMST, down to no. Um, you can also take them in the pointless to have them on the X's, which in actual fact they're already off the X's, aren't they? Because that just doesn't make any sense at all. Okay, so yeah, that's how you take that data off the Z report. So if we now TLS to leave it, escape cancel to get back to the main menu. Um, can't really run another Z report. I have to put a quick sale through. I should have done an X report beforehand. I'll run a Z now. I've put a sale through. Resetting general. Still got the training mode turned on there, but obviously you can turn that off if you want. Um, it's just more concise, I think. You haven't got pointless free lots of GTs on there. You've got your departments. Uh, your net, your tax, and all the key, all the function key information would be on there. So if people have been doing voids or no sales or refunds, that would be on there, and then your different methods of payment as well. Uh, yeah, I hope that video has been helpful. Um, there's plenty of other videos on programming and using the 307, some of which will be appearing on screen now. You're welcome to watch those. You can also subscribe to this YouTube channel or visit sharphelp.co.uk for more. Thanks for watching.